Ah, hello, my friends, and welcome back. Thank you very much for being with me again today. Today, I will challenge the British intelligence data, their intelligence, and I will do it mathematically. So, I will not talk words and just, uh, you know, I will say and I will use generalities. I will use numbers, logic, and probabilities. Okay, let's go. This article that is in the title says that uh, comes from the voice, the new voice of Ukraine from today, June 24th, 2022. And this is the title, Russia using Wagner group, Wagner pilots due to insufficient trained personnel, says UK intelligence. Okay. So they say, uh, they, the UK intelligence, who has a low credibility in my books because of the intelligence they provided in Iraq, remember? Um, uh, and uh, I will put that aside. I want to make it mathematically. I have doubts and I'm very skeptical that that's true. I don't think it's any, any uh, intelligence provided and no study conducted in order to reach that conclusion. So, Russia is using mercenary pilots from the Wagner private military company due to insufficient, insufficient numbers of suitable trained personnel caused by its combat losses in the war against Ukraine, the UK Defense Minister said in its uh, daily intelligence assessment of, on June 24th. Okay, it says that the ministry noted that Ukrainian forces captured a Russian pilot, one, uh, who admitted of being mercenary Wagner mercenary. Admitted. Nevertheless, the mercenary also reported, reportedly said, reportedly it means that some say something, uh, said that uh, he, in this case, this mercenary reported. Uh, he uh, relied on commercial GPS equipment instead of military grade avionics to conduct his missions, which may be a sign of older equipment being pre uh, pressed into service over major losses in the war against Ukraine, the UK MOD noted. Low morale, blah, blah, blah. Okay, it says here that, uh, so they say this is, <clears throat> they don't have pilots anymore, trained pilots, so they will get from the Wagner group uh, pilots. All right, well, let's put some, um, put some, how do you call it, uh, numbers here. In this war, in the four months, Ukraine reported, which is always inflated, reported that they shot down 216 Russian airplanes. 216, okay? Probably there's less than that because, you know, they maximize the Russians say, no, it's only five that you shot down. You know how it works. But let's give it to them the whole amount. 216, okay? How many airplanes do you think, how many jets are in the air in Ukraine at one point? 1,000? 5,000, 1 million, 3, how many are? All right, let me go to this little information. And let's say what was the total of fighter jets or, or air power in Russia in 2022, so this year. And I got this from Wyon, and they get uh, from today, uh, no, it's actually from February, 20, February 4th, 2022, so at the beginning of the hostilities. The report comes, this report comes from the World Air Force report from 2022. They claim that, and I'm, I'm quoting, according to World Air Force report 2022, Russia has the third largest combat aircraft fleet size in the world with 1,571 planes. It says planes behind the US and China. So let's see. So they have, let's say 1,500, let's make it round, 1,500. These guys shot down 200, right? It was 216, all right? Now, how many do you think, how many airplanes do you think are in the air at one point? I don't think there are the rest, which would be uh, 1,300, all right? I don't think it's going to be 1,300, even if there were 1,300 in the air, which they're not. If there will be 1,300 in the air, I think uh, Ukraine will be uh, raised to the ground right now. So nevertheless, so they, they destroyed 200 out of, let's say, 1,500. 
So that means Russia potentially remains with 1,300. Uh, 1,300. So that means that you need about 1,300 pilots to be ready flying. Which I said, it, there's not all the 1,300 flying. Probably they use about in rotation, probably 50, 20, 30. Do you think they use? No, they don't use the 1,300. So they use, well, let's say, as I said, 50. They need, that means they need at least 50 pilots. Some of them are, are piloted by two. So let's make it 100 pilots flying every day, which I don't, I doubt it, every day, because when you read the articles, it says, oh, a rocket went over there, it shot down over there. They don't say, well, it was a big bombardment of the airplanes or so on. So even if I take it that way, there would not be 30. I'm giving you, I'm giving you five, 50, 50 in the air every day, 50 in the air. 50, let's multiply by two pilots, let's say. That's 100 pilots. Do you think that, and then remember, 200 were shot down, according to Ukrainians. So that's, let's say, 200 is 400 pilots, if they would be doubled. I maximize their claims, you know what I mean, to make it even impossible for me, you know, to, to uh, uh, counter, to uh, counter argument, bring counter arguments. So let's say 200 airplanes, let's say all of them were piloted by two, even though it was that guy who was one pilot. So let's say it's 400 pilots killed. Then the Russians are using 50 every day. That's, let's say, double it. I give it to them. <coughs> there would be 100 pilots. So there would be, what, 500 pilots. So do you think that Russia does not have 500 pilots? And you say, no. Okay, why not? Do you think Russia started training its pilots a week ago? A month ago, a year ago, 10 years ago? They trained all, let's say they trained, how many tr pilots do you think they have their training at one time? Russia. Russia have an, an, uh, a population of 100 and almost 50, 145 uh, million people. Would be fair to say that they train at one time 1,000 pilots a year? Okay, no, not 100, no, not 1,000. Let's make it, cut it into, 500. Do you think they are rotating and training 500 pilots uh, a year? No, we don't think so. 200? You see, I'm minimizing my argument in order to show that even if I maximize theirs and I minimize mine, I will still win, which means they are lying. Okay, let's say they do 200 a year. When do they start training? So let's say you do, will not put a guy who's over 50 on an airplane, even though that guy was 53 or whatever he was. So let's say you put fi uh, below 50. So 50 is 10 years to 40, to 30, to 20. So you've got 30 years. So let's say you start back in what? 30 years from now, uh, 30 years back is what? 1991, right? 1992. So in 992, you have pilots that potentially could fly right now. So 992, you multiply with 200, at least 200 a year. I give you the impossible 200 instead of giving you 1,000 a year. And you multiply that and you get to at least 600, don't you? And what, 6,000? I mean, you go from 200, you go, you go from, uh, what did I say, uh, 200 a year, right? 200 a year, multiply with 30 years in order to have people from 20 years to uh, 50. It's 30 years, right? So that's what, 6,000 over there? So Russia should have at least 6,000. And remember, they are using a, only, I gave you more, 50 air, aircraft jets a day. 50 with two pilots on it. So there would be, as I said, 100. With, let's say, 400, they were killed over there, right? 200 airplanes, let's say two. I give you 600. They have at, at least, they got at least 5,400 more pilots. That were trained. They are pilots. You think they're all a Wagner group? I mean, how extraordinary this claim is. And I gave you my, my counter argument was all limited. I said 200 pilots a, a year, instead of saying 1,000. If it would be 1,000, I would get to 32,000, 30, 30,000 people, 30,000 pilots available. So I gave you the 200 and I got to 6,000 pilots now that Russia should have between the age of 20 and, and 50, not 20 and 60 or 55. I gave these guys that they shot down 200. Probably they shot less than that. I gave, I gave them that is two pilots one airplane, which would be 400 uh, pilots killed in all those 100 uh, uh, airplanes, which is not that. I gave you that they fly 50, uh, 50 airplanes a day. 
uh, in the air at one moment, which I don't think there are more than five or ten. We will hear that. The mass, mass media will say, my God, and it's nothing like that. I would give maybe 15 at the most. I gave 50. I can give 100. And if I give 100, there would be 200 pilots. Russia doesn't have 200 pilots. I already proved with that with a minimum of 200 a year. They would just uh, they would just have right now 6,000 available. So this is a big, big lie mathematically. How do you want me to do it? How, do, how else? How else do you want me to prove it? These guys are just lying. You know why? Because they're trying to make to make uh, uh, to form an opinion that Russia uses Wagner mercenaries in the airplanes because that guy was caught ruffled up a little bit to say what he said. And there you have him. Now they're all Wagner group, all Wagner group. You see? Thank you, uh, UK uh, intelligence. I don't believe shit what you say. Nothing. Zero. Thank you very much for being with me again today. Stay strong, stay smart, look for the truth and be just.